Good afternoon. My name is Christopher. They call me Champion. I would like to welcome my viewers to the cut here in the backwoods. It's where I live. Um, we're taking this channel on a new avenue, okay? And, and yes, that's that's we, guys. Do you guys know that fear is addictive? Yep. And nothing good comes of it, okay? It can be a very powerful motivator, which is what I was using it for, guys, okay? But in that same regard, it can stop you in your tracks, okay? We're not going to do that here on this channel. I'm going to help you guys get ready, but with education, motivation, and encouragement, okay? So we'll start with education, then we'll get into motivation, and then we'll get into encouragement, okay? Uh, you're wild edible. You guys, well, that, that one leaf is closed. Here's a bunch of them. You guys recognize that plant, right? Yeah. Clovers, guys. They're edible. And they're, they're, they're vinegary. They're, they're tangy like a, like a citrus, like a citrus uh, fruit, guys. My mouth was watering just getting ready to eat them. These are very good, guys. You know, if you, like, if you like sour stuff, this is the wild edible for you. I encourage all of my viewers to go out. Mm, it's good, guys. And try some clovers, okay? The light green ones, are they got some kick, guys, for real. You're going to like them, okay? Clovers, wild edible, okay? You guys recognize that? Do you know what those are? That's a walnut. Yeah, and it's on the ground. And I do not want them on the ground. I want them in the tree getting big, fat, and hearty, but they're not. It fell to the ground. We're gonna, I'm going to tell you why, okay? Um, got a bunch of them, guys. They're all over, you know? There's a certain species of moth called a cuddling moth, okay? And the cuddling moth will lay its larva on the branches of oak trees, you know, and in the right season, the eggs will hatch, and they'll crawl out, and the little worm will find a fruit and burrow in it, okay? And, and I, I did some things. If you haven't noticed, my hands are free. Um, I've been thinking about making more quality videos, having my hands to be able to talk with and this and that. Um, so I, I set up some things, and we're going to get a look at that worm in there, okay, guys? So stay tuned for that, okay? Uh, so let, 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 let me say this. My name is not Ace, and I'm no detective, but I sure could use a pet, guys, for real, you know? So I started laying out saltine crackers, you know? One cracker one day, two the next, three, four more, you know what I mean? And uh, I was surprised by the result it got, guys. You know, there is now a family of 200 chipmunks who have taken up residence all around my structure, guys. 200 of them. There's rustling in the leaves all day, guys. And it's nice. You know, I talk to them, and if you don't know, is the is the chipmunk call? <laughs> um, yeah, it hasn't worked yet. They haven't come up to me or taken a, a cracker out of my hand. Uh, you know, and I haven't. I have not met Alvin or Theodore yet, but if I do, I'll be sure to introduce you guys, okay? So let's get a look at this uh, cuddling moth larva, right? So, and I'm taking into consideration that some of my viewers may have motion sickness, so if you'll give me just a moment. Okay, let's begin. Um, got a bunch here, so if I, if I can't find one in, in, in one, I'll split another, okay? Then I got just a couple more things I want to show you here in the backwoods, okay? Um, I, ne I, never, I never hit my hatchet with my hammer. I always use a piece of wood because it'll give. You know, I, I just, and I, I broke probably two of these hatchets. They're fairly cheap, you know? Um, so I try to preserve what I have. There he is. Let's pull him out of there, see if we can get him, okay? Yep, there he is. It's pretty tiny right now, you know, but if this fruit would have stayed in the tree, guys, he'd have been giant, you know. So that's a cuddling moth larva, okay? So if you see a cuddling moth, do me a favor, smush it, okay? Let's talk about, let's talk about walnuts for a second, guys, okay? Uh, so, so there's the meat on the inside, okay? It looks like a nut, Right, but it is not good to eat. Okay, so so there's the fruit. Right, I know it all looks the same, doesn't it? You know, let me see if I can get a, a better one here. Where'd they go? So anyway, 
Um, on the outside of the walnut, there's a green flesh that you have to peel off, okay? Because the, the nut meat, the, the, yeah, the nut meat will be liquid and you have to let it dry and harden like you do a cake when it comes out of the oven. You, know, you gotta let it cool down, but you, you know, it takes about 30 days in order to be able to um, crack your nuts and eat them and not have it, have it be a big pile of goo. No. Um, so let's go back up top and then I have just a, one more thing I wanna tell you guys. I'm trying to get into um, some routine, guys. You know, stuff that you can count on, stuff that you can look forward to in this channel. And one of the things that I, I'm going to make a habit is to leave you guys with a quote, okay? Um, first, let's talk about the future of this channel. Um, tomorrow, uh, it's supposed to be raining for the next three days. So uh, weather permitting, I'll be making a video down at, uh, at the at Creekside to teach you guys how to catch minnows, okay? It's very easy, guys. And also a frog trap, okay? Because I want you guys to have this information so that way when things, if things go bad, you guys have it and you're, you can be more confident, okay? Confidence is the difference, okay? Between waiting and struggling and giving up and confidence in this is important, let me educate myself and when stuff, when and if stuff goes bad, you guys have it and you can, you can struggle and then overcome, okay? Um, so I'll leave you with a quote, okay? And I'm not going to just pull a random quote, guys. It's going to be something that means something to me. So let me highlight it like this, okay? Guys, I'm doing what I love, okay? And I want to encourage all of my viewers to do what they love, okay? No matter, no matter, no matter what, okay? There's only one person at the end of the day that matters, guys. And that's you and your relationship to yourself, guys. You know, how do you see your reflection? So the quote that I have comes from a poem called Man in the Glass, or if you're a female watching my video, Gal in the Glass, okay? Goes like this, and this is paraphrasing. Um, Down the pathway of years, you may get pats on the back as you pass, but your only reward will be heartaches and tears if you've cheated the man or gal in the glass. That's all I got for you guys today. You know, If you like the new content of this video, if you like me having my hands free and the stuff and where I wanna direct this uh, channel to go, um, I encourage you to drop a like. Okay, much love from me to you here in the backwoods. I'll catch you guys tomorrow for tomorrow's video.